32 and today we're going to be playing the final part of Mega Man X2. So let's just get right into the stage and the stage looks familiar. Anybody? Okay, this is actually the same stage as the uh Magna Centipede stage. And if you select him on the map, you will actually come here to the final stage. So interesting. Trivia. So let's just avoid the spotlights again. There's not really any point now. I'll just wait for these. Keep going. It's still Magnus Centipede's stage. Not much changes until you reach Sigma. Um, keep going. Avoid that trap. Yes, the same stage. Just do the same things. And then you just get to the other side. Very slowly. Okay, so now we are where the um, mini boss was. But, no, this time we're gonna find Sigma, Return from the Dead, and Zero. Look who I found wandering around, Mega Man. My friend has a, he has a small problem with you. It seems that you let him die, and he's not too happy about that. Now I think it's time that he repays the favor. Oh. Nope. Oh hey, it's Zero. Sigma, you should have studied the blueprints closer. There's only one Zero. Wait, Zero, I know your secret. You're destined to follow me. Maybe, but I still don't like you. Fine, if you will not follow me, you will die. Zero. Sorry to keep you waiting, Mega Man X. The greetings will have to wait. We've got to defeat all the Mavericks, including Sigma. I'll take out the main computer, and you follow Sigma. Let's go! Oh, well, Zero's back. That's great. Here it is, X. Sigma lies just ahead. Okay, let's... Actually, let's go back. Before we go any deeper, let's go back and see what happens if we didn't collect all the Zero parts. Okay, we're back in the room. Everything's good. Sigma appears. Red Zero appears. Real Zero. Sigma says the same things. Zero's wandering around, apparently, after dying. And, uh... It says the same things, and it's a little different this time. Instead of Real Zero coming in to solve the problem, we actually have to fight him. So, uh, I think his weakness... I don't know, let me think about it. But if you fire a double charge shot at him, some of your charge shots will actually counter his charge shots. So, it's a pretty cool effect, um, about how evenly matched they are. And e But even if you do uh, match all of those charge shots, he's still got the little saber beam shot firing at you. So, you're not really evenly matched. Plus, he's a boss. So, I don't know. If you're on the wall, he'll dash over to- Or, if, you, if you're above him, he'll dash over to you and knock some rocks from the ground into your face. So, watch out for that. And I believe his weakness is actually the speed burn. So, just hit him with that. I think it wouldn't matter. I would just use the X Buster anyway. It depends on how you want to fight him. You just keep shooting him and dashing. It's a pattern. You just jump off the wall, shoot him, jump off the wall. And there you go, he's down. Zero. Dun, dun, dun. Do you remember me? No period? Yeah, I guess so. Sorry to cause you so much trouble. X, you need to go after Sigma. I'll go, try and go ahead and destroy the main computer. Take care of yourself, Zero. I don't have time to put you back together again. I'll be okay. Get going, X. So, uh, takes out the hole, the ground, and he just leaves. So now we can go back to the regular timeline. About now. Okay, good. Let's fight Sigma. 
again. Fall down this really long hole. And Sonic Slicer is Neo Sigma's first weakness. So there he is. That's nice music. You are merely a bothersome insect, Mega Man X. It is about time that I crush you beneath my heel. About time, I already- Oh, Wolverine Claws. This is an exciting development here. He has claws now. So, uh, he'll kind of fly around, but he'll run into your Sonic Slicers. So, um, this boss isn't as nearly as hard as the original Sigma boss was. So, if you can beat the original one, then don't worry about this. Um, I think he's... I don't know. Those electric moves, some of the electric moves that he has, they kind of remind me of Spark Mandrill from the first one. Like, that right there. That kind of reminds me of the full charge shots that you get from Spark Mandrill. The full, um, Dr. Light charge shot thing. But, uh, there we go, we got him. So, is that the end of the game? No, we gotta fight a second form. Which will come in a moment. And has no health bar. Just appears. And it's 3D. Super, super Nintendo 3D graphics. So, I think this is called Virus Sigma. And, um, if he is green, then that means he is healthy. And if he is turning blue, that means I've d done something right. And if he turns red, that means he's about to explode. So, I think he can turn orange as well. So, um, since he has no health bar, that just tells you how he's doing. So when he d fires this laser, you're going to want to kind of climb on the slide down the wall, because he won't be able to hit you like that. Or you can just climb over him, I guess. And then he'll keep spawning in these enemies randomly. So if you ever run out of ammo, you can just get it from those guys. Maybe. But I think I'm doing pretty good. And let's just keep picking his ears with the strike chain, his weakness. And he's turning orange. Okay, that's good. That's good so far. Uh, okay, when he turns red, or orange, or whatever. He'll start teleporting around, because he's almost dead. But he will still pull off some of the moves. Oh, we got him! And now there's some, uh, bees buzzing around that I hear. Now Sigma's trying to speak. Can't. And he's just kinda disappearing and exploding. And some text. Mega Man X, I have lost to you again. Each defeat only makes me stronger and serves to bring you closer to your ultimate doom. But something is not right. I don't quite understand. Why did you? He is the last of the Doctor's creations. Arrgh. Okay, since we just teleported, we're not out of the castle, we just teleported up a little bit, so let's run out of here before we explode. And then teleport onto another cliff. Watch this beautiful sunset for an ending. Oh, hey, it's zero. And there's X. <coughs> Joined by his friend Zero, Mega Man X gazes o over the sea. Sigma has once again been destroyed, but X wonders if the fighting will truly end. Sound familiar, anybody? 
Was Dr. Light's dream of a world in which reploids and humans live together in peace merely a dream? The price of peace is often high, X thinks to himself. Yeah, think it out loud, X. And you forgot the quotations or the italics. Who or what must be sacrificed for it to become a reality? And when the time comes, will he be able to do it? I don't know, it depends on what it is. The future holds the answers. Or... Credits, let's just head down this highway on a, on a little speeder bike. Look at the Mega Man X2 cast. All of these guys we blew up a few times. Can a driver scriber, ball big scribble, slime down and back on. Gigantic mechanoid, crew copper, weather, blah, that's your shot. I don't want to read all of these, but. Well, yeah, you get the idea. And, um. Hang to Reploid. Wow. Well, that's it for Mega Man X2. Uh, I don't think this game has any credits for me to read. There's this this stuff for the um, Mavericks that you fought, so it's kind of I don't say boring, but like, maybe hide the credits. Some is it? It's probably the same team, but the credits aren't in here, and it just kind of bothers me a little bit because I can't mispronounced names. Well, we'll just keep cruising along the highway. And now let's take a look at these bosses. Uh, let's see. Nobody's power is over 9,000. Yes. Bubble Crab. Speed. 4,800. I don't know what that means. Uh, Flame Stack. Speed is 7,000. Crystal Snail is kind of slow, I can see. Whoa, his speed is over 9,000. And so is Wheel Gator's powder. Pa powder, powder, yes. Whoa, all of their stuff is over 9,000. Okay, I don't know, it doesn't seem like Surge's was so strong. He just kind of has a little vehicle. What about Zero and X? And you. Mega Man X power power unknown. <laughs> I'll just keep it that way for a while. And that is the end of Mega Man X. Uh, let's see. Next, I'll probably play Super Mario or Mega Man X2, I suppose. But uh, next, I'll be playing either Super Mario World for the SNES or Chrono Trigger for the DS or PlayStation. Not the Super Nintendo for various reasons, but, um, like and subscribe if you liked the video, and, uh, peace and cheap.